We're gonna clean my desk. My hair smells so good. I'm trying this new shampoo and it smells, holy shit, it smells so good. Hello, hi, welcome. So it's official, a new term has begun. Yes, woo. I am excited, but my desk is an absolute disaster. While we're still at the beginning of this new term, this new semester, I am going to do a nice declutter, clean out, my desk slash my altar. So if you don't know, my like working altar where I do most of my spells and stuff is also my desk because you know, we live in a smaller space and I obviously share that space with my partner. So I like to keep things concise and it kind of works because they actually kind of intersect a lot. I go to school for writing and my writing craft and my witchcraft kind of like very much intersect. That's not the point of this video. First, let me show you what we're dealing with. So this is the situation. Um, not pretty. That That's also like a piece of my altar. That's my entire desk. My witchy cabinet's a mess. So I made that. I'm so happy about it. Basically, uh, it's a disaster. And right now I have like Zoom classes and stuff. So I need to be using this altar. And that's obviously not happening. <laughs> And I literally have a class today, so I'm trying to get this done ASAP. Don't people always say less chatting, more doing? Let's do that. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So my plan is to kind of separate my super witchy stuff. Like we have a bunch of these bowls and stuff. I'm going to put a lot of stuff onto that smaller altar table you saw. Also, I have a lot of stuff to put in my witchy cabinet. I've set that up here so I can put things away. Stuff. I have like this second layer here, like this step stool I use as like another layer. These magazines I'm gonna use for my class today. We're apparently cutting up and doing something, so we'll see. So I have all my like charm bags. Look at this one from Turkey with the little fill in the czars on them. So all my charm bags. We have some eggshells, some extra eggshells. Charm bags, let's put it here. Should I put my bookmarks in my witchy cabinet? Um, yeah. So did I put everything in the cabinet? Is everything good? I don't want to put this away. I want to have it out with my other Totoro thing, but maybe I do need to put it away for now. Going in the witchy cabinet. Ta-da! We did one part. And then I just close her up like this. Great. Don't need to charge this. I can put the chargers away. I'm basically like making an altar for Hakate. Any other Turkish witches out there, let me know if you feel drawn to her because I have a lot of information to give you. But basically, the cauldron, all the witchy stuff, will be going on that table. Lavender bundle. Um, actually, I don't need the lavender bundle. Also, this entire freaking plate needs to be cleaned out. Honestly, some of this is left over from teaching my boyfriend witchcraft. This candle's completely done. I'm just gonna clean this out, I'll be back. My class is literally going to start so soon, so I need to hurry the hell up. I'm gonna do less talking and more just rearranging. Okay, I'll come back to show you the final results. sitting in this thing for seven hours. Do you like all my pillows and blankets and stuff I use to make it like actually
actually comfortable doing something with the candle, it will be going somewhere else. The plant, my glasses, and the little marker stuff will stay there. The cabinet is right there and it's all organized now. And what do we have here? On the wall, we have my Nazar and a painting. We have Polaroids of me and my boyfriend, literary witches, like some cards of them. Virginia Woolf's the first one there. Oh, we have my crystal ball. So we have my tarot cards in this beautiful train. And we have a little Jahiro pen on it too. It's so cute. We have my wand, special pen, scissors, a protection thing my boyfriend carved for me, um, and a porcupine quill. I did a haul. You can see porcupine quill fully. Then we come over here. Information on all of that stuff. Um, you can watch my building an altar video. So that's that's all that. These are honestly feathers I've just oh, found um, on the ground on walks and stuff. I seem to always find feathers and I find myself very lucky in that sense. And these are three feathers I've collected. Got some land spirit stuff with my trees oracle deck down there. Oh, and that bark is actually from the forest right next to my home. Also, that's the clay from the witchy Christmas haul video. And then the coyote bone that's here. From my other witchy haul, and this is some water. We got some nice Turkish tea, my special mix um, in here. And I'm starting a new pothos plant. In the bedroom tour again video, you can see my pothos plant. Do you remember the ropes and stuff? Like, along my ceiling it literally went all along my ceiling like that's how big it had gotten now this one was just like one little baby like piece like this and it's grown a lot since then and yeah hopefully I will also grow it like the last one because that would be so fun it's cute right it's a cute little area and I have all my like extra stuff down there on the stool just extra things and this is not done yet um, because I'm going to put some herbs here and make some black salt. But this is the basic idea, so I'm just filming it now because <laughs> I'm tired. Oh, these aren't gonna stay here. This is what my working altar looks like, even though I use both like the desk and this um, to do my workings. Welcome. Welcome to the desk I've been occupying for this entire freaking day. I love COVID learning. I really do, honestly. Doing creative writing on Zoom. This is my desk and that was my altar. I don't wanna do like a day in the life, but like do one online and then one in person just to see for myself how different my days are. I still haven't eaten. I'm going to make dinner. I mean, I had breakfast today. I haven't like not eaten at all, but it's been a, it's been a minute since I've had food. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you got some inspiration for your desk or altar or whatever. That's literally it, guys. I wish I had a cool story to tell you about, but literally that's all. Thank you for spending time with me. Please subscribe if you have not subscribed. It really helps me out a lot and I can make more videos. <laughs> I'm at 200 subscribers, which is like so nice, so cute. Yeah, and sometimes I don't get notified when someone subscribes, but I love stalking you guys, especially if you have like, I don't know, playlists or like, <laughs> is this weird? Ugh, I'm so tired. Okay, thank you guys for my like half lazy um, desk cleanup video. I hope you got something out of it. Bye.